Hurricane Helene is coming. She's expected to make landfall Thursday somewhere near or around Tallahassee, Florida. And of course, we are praying for the folks of Florida, Georgia, Alabama, Tennessee, all the southeastern states that are in the path of this terrible, terrible storm. Now, living on the Gulf Coast myself, I can say with 1,000% assurance that these events are never fun. They are always very difficult to deal with, not only logistically, but also mentally and spiritually as well. When a hurricane rolls into your city, it is a very trying experience because oftentimes you're wondering, does my state have enough? Do we have enough resources? Do we have enough personnel? Do we have enough manpower to run the rescue operations and the recovery efforts? And as I can attest, even big states like Texas, wealthy states, need help when these big storms roll into town. And that is why I'm such a huge proponent of regional government throughout North America. For this hurricane, Hurricane Helene, it's expected to make landfall in Florida. If we had a regional system in place, we could have workers, we could have emergency responders coming in already lined up from states like Texas, Louisiana, Mississippi, Alabama, ready to arrive immediately after this hurricane passes through town. That means utility workers, that means first responders, that means logistics experts. Anyone and everyone who is built to deal with hurricanes could be coming in from Texas, Louisiana, Mississippi, Alabama, and be ready to hit the ground as soon as the storm passes. Why? Because all of these states are experts at dealing with hurricane and hurricane recovery cleanup efforts. All of them have faced these very same problems. And all of them could be very instrumental in making sure the recovery process not only is smooth, but goes a lot quicker than normal. And it's not just the Gulf Coast states who have faced these types of storms before. The Upper South also has encountered some very severe storms and tornadoes. So you could also bring in crews from places like Oklahoma, Arkansas, Tennessee, Missouri, Kentucky, the Carolinas, Virginia, you could have a full on regional effort every single time one of these storms rolls into town. And with this kind of regional coordination, everything would be figured out ahead of time. The pay rates for the workers, where do we send people? How many people do we send? What skill sets are the most needed for the particular area the storm is impacting? I know had we had this system in place, when Hurricane Barrel rolled through Houston, we would have been a lot better off. And that's not to impugn anyone who came in to assist with the recovery effort in Houston. We certainly appreciate it. But I'm just stating facts here. When you have more resources available that are coordinated and ready to go as soon as the storm passes, you're just going to have a better recovery effort. So one of the many reasons I'm a big proponent, I'm hugely in favor of regional government within North America because this formula applies to every single region of the country, not just the South. So if you have an area of the country that experiences earthquakes, the states within that region can assist each other the same way the southern states, the Gulf states, will assist each other with hurricanes. Example, if there's an earthquake in California, states like Oregon, states like Washington State can send in resources, boom, immediately after the quake is done. If you have a nor'easter that comes in to New England, boom, all the states in that region can assist one another immediately. And the great thing is they all know what they're doing because they've all handled these types of storms before. So I'm a huge fan of regional government. Quite frankly, it makes so much sense. And it's something that we should be working on right now. Now, if these ideas are intriguing to you, I encourage you to check out my book, The New Way, available on Amazon.com. In The New Way, you're going to find ideas such as regional government, and why it makes sense for all the peoples of North America. Now, this is Kevin in Texas saying, God bless all the people of Florida, of Georgia, Alabama, Tennessee, every state that this storm, Hurricane Helene, will impact. We're praying for you. We're keeping you in our thoughts with a desire that everyone gets out of the way of what appears to be a very dangerous storm. This is Kevin in Texas saying, God bless you, and I'll talk to you later. Bye.